Prolixin is a brand name for the antipsychotic drug flufenazine. This drug belongs to a class of medications called typical or conventional antipsychotics, which work by blocking dopamine receptors in the brain. By blocking these receptors, prolixin helps to reduce the symptoms of conditions such as schizophrenia, manic episodes associated with bipolar disorder, and other psychiatric disorders. The starting dose of prolixin depends on the individual and the condition being treated. Typically, the starting dose for adults with schizophrenia is 2.5 to 5 mg per day, taken in two divided doses. This can be increased gradually up to a maximum of 40 mg per day, depending on the individual's response. Like all medications, prolixin can cause side effects. Common side effects include drowsiness, dry mouth, blurred vision, constipation, and weight gain. In some cases, prolixin can also cause movement disorders, such as tardive dyskinesia, which is characterized by repetitive and involuntary movements of the mouth, tongue, and other parts of the body. Prolixin is contraindicated in individuals with a history of sensitivity or allergic reactions to flufenazine or any other ingredients in the formulation. It should also be used with caution in patients with a history of seizures or a history of liver or kidney disease. The recommended laboratory test before starting prolixin include complete blood count, CBC, liver function tests, LFTs, kidney function tests, KFTs, fasting glucose, A1C, lipid profile, electrolyte levels, and thyroid function tests, TFTs. It is also recommended to monitor for changes in weight and blood pressure. It is also important to review the patient's medical history, including any pre-existing conditions and any current medications they are taking. There is a warning issued by the United States Food and Drug Administration, FDA, regarding the risk of mortality in elderly patients with dementia-related psychosis who are treated with antipsychotics. The warning states that these drugs have been associated with an increased risk of death in elderly patients with dementia-related psychosis compared to those who do not take the drugs. It is important for patients and healthcare providers to be aware of this warning and weigh the potential benefits and risks of treatment before starting or continuing therapy with prolixin.